Hi, I'm Dr. Carolyn Mine, and today we're going to be identifying the effects of the electromagnetic field, otherwise known as EMFs, on the body. Muscle testing is a good diagnostic tool. It's a good way of communicating with the body. And one of the ways to determine whether a person is testable is to ask various different questions. So I like to use a strong muscle. That's why I like to use the arm muscle. This is actually a very general muscle. And if I have you just apply steady pressure towards your head, then I've got strength in this particular muscle. Would you just say your name, say my name is, and state your name. My name is Lisa. And when I test this muscle, this muscle is strong. Say, my name is Jane. My name is Jane. Hold this arm real tight, and you notice that there's a weakness. What this indicates is that the body knows the difference between what is true and what isn't. We can also use this way of communicating with the body because this way we can determine what's true for the body that's not necessarily what a person is consciously aware of. I'll use muscle testing as a way of checking the effect of the cell phone on the body. So checking for a strong muscle, now we have strength. When I introduce the cell phone to the body, to the body's energy field, then we're getting a weakness, which indicates that there's more stress on the system. This is an EMF neutralizer device. What it does is it neutralizes the negative effect of the electromagnetic field on the body. It does not interfere with the function of the phone in any way. And just check and see what effect that has. By putting this next to the, the battery and checking the various different areas, this will neutralize the negative effect of the electromagnetic field. The EMF neutralizer and devices such as this can be placed over the battery or in the carrying case. This will eliminate the negative effects the electromagnetic fields have on the body.